All right, this is the last night of our boondocking tour of the ghost towns and abandoned towns, and we're in Kramer Junction in Boron on 395 and Highway 58, and here we are, boondocking. Compliments of roadhouse, restaurant, and bakery. Here's a town. Here's a truck next to us. Here's the highway, and I'll take you into town and uh, we'll see what we can find. Here's the uh, closed Arco station. I've never seen a closed Arco station. Of course, we got lots of trash that built up. There's our RV as we boondock here. We'll head out here to the underpass, cruise up, see what's here. All right, let's give it a shot. Welcome to Kramer Junction. This place is pretty cool. It's like a picker's place. You got all these great signs. Maybe uh, Route 66. We got Lyon, Sinclair, Richfield, Texaco, Rare to Go Frontier, Antiques, Phillips 66, another old Texaco, King Edward Cigars, an old tractor. Here we got the development plot, Kramer Junction. So we're parked right now, right by what would be the O in Arco. But it's uh, obviously closed in a vacant lot. Here it looks like, a, like an old foster freeze. Definitely a little ice cream shack place. Got some broken windows. Big old barrier in front of the door here. You got big old barriers in front of those doors too. Anything in the back? Hey! Lots of graffiti. How about that? All right. No ice cream, sorry. But next door, we got the drive-in Astro Burger. Now these are the best burgers you find out here at Kramer Junction. But of course, looks like it's closed. Hey, out back, we got a bunch of junk. We got some 55 gallon drums of trash. I don't know what's leaked down here pallets, more trash. Hey, now this is cool. Now this is a baker's rack. Everybody needs a baker's rack. Now here we got a chandelier. wonder if that works. Probably take that home. Fresh broccoli. Alright. Here we got a book. Let's see what people are reading out here in Boron. Quick Commander. Oh, the Duck Hunter Commander Faith and Family Bible. So what's on the menu today for Astro Burger? Ice cream, frozen. JR Burgers, 269. This food looks really good. No refills, 60 cents. Used to be a uh, A graded restaurant. It's all locked up. It's inside here. Not sure you can see the reflection. But restrooms are for customers only. Outdoor seating. We lost a pair of glasses. Here we got a nice weed here. Now you might want to call this a tumbleweed, but it's not really tumbleweed. Well, you know what? This might be a Russian thistle tumbleweed. Came in from Russia in the late 1800s from a contaminated shipment of grain. 
all the way from Siberia, Russian thistle. Well, say goodbye to Astro Burger Drive-In. I bet this place is fantastic. Over here, we have an old switch station. Let's see what it looks like inside through the broken glass. Yeah, it looks like water and electrical might have been here. There we go. Huh. What's left of Astro Burger and whatever else is here, which of course is not here either. The BNNS Railway comes right here. Moving freight from Los Angeles to way out there. The BNSF through Kramer Junction. Here we have the Chevron station. And over here, the 76 station. And over here, we have the Pilot. Pilot's always good for gas and all sorts of stuff in the back. Over here, we have the old pottery shop. And at least they're open. Check out this cool pottery. Scary little figurines back here. Oh my. Down here is the truck center for parking your truck overnight. You have pilot and subway. Gasoline, $5.29 for super unleaded. Which by the way is not a horrible price nowadays. Happy Valentine's Day to my beautiful wife of many, many years and decades. Now on the end of Kramer Junction, we have the power switch station up here. Of course, we have this lot here. This is another boondocking lot, but I think uh, it's better to park where we are. And this is a great little shop. Pots, benches, there's like a heron, we got agaves and yuccas, we got some cacti. This is the Cactus and Gifts, open 9 to 5. It's called the Cactus Shop, the desert's best kept secret. Here's where you buy all your cacti and western garden paraphernalia. And here we have the giant desert tortoise. There's another side building. It's called the gift outlet. And you get all sorts of nooks and nicks and knickknacks and anything else. Everybody's welcome when they're open. We have Burger King and they replaced Astro Burger. But the cost is a lot more and the food's not as good. Two for six dollars. Here's the Roadhouse restaurant. Now this is a great little restaurant for breakfast, lunch and dinner. Little restaurant and bakery. It's been here for a long time and they survived COVID and the downturn in the economy. Proves they're a good little diner. Roadhouse diner restaurant. And we have the 76 station. And over here, this is the barn and Chester's is coming soon. Right next to the roadhouse, we have the barn 76 liquor store. Well, they have a Bitcoin ATM inside. And they're up to date with the Bitcoin ATM. Let's go buy some food. Here we got an old something. I don't know, maybe a mobile station. Used to be here. 
Do not disturb. Here's a nice little shack behind one of the buildings. Looks a little bit decrepit, but it's still a shack. All right, so boondocking here, it's a, a little bit depressing, as you can see. But you know what? The price is right because it's free. In a little local restaurant, it opens at five o'clock in the morning for breakfast, for coffee and eggs, whatever you want. So that's kind of a cool thing about boondocking here at Kramer Junction. Well, I think that's about the end of this Kramer Junction video. So, hope you had a good time. Thanks. Bye.